In honor of Black History Month, I'm excited to interview several black leaders who have inspired our generation and making a difference in our community. Dr. King, I love him because, you know, he's a pastor, I'm a pastor. He was a spiritual leader, I'm a spiritual leader. And he, he was able to dream, and he believed that one day people would come together. Me seeing him do that let me know that anything could be possible in my life. In my generation, well, it was Reverend Jesse Jackson, you know, back in the 80s when he ran for president and done all the marching and stuff like that. So he was really instrumental in moving it forward. And even for in the late 80s and the early 90s, when Oprah came around with her talk show, she helped a lot and helped bring people together like that. I guess the one that comes to my mind is the reason we're here, Carter G. Woodson, who is known as the father of black history. And uh, back in 1926, he had a vision of, of uh, black history, which was celebrating one week out of the month. And here we are, 93 years later, still embracing that black history. And it has expanded from a week to a month. Andrew Young, Congressman John Lewis, President Barack Obama. But we also have a, a local author, Dr. Weddington. He wrote a book, uh, he Salt of the Earth, uh, Georgia Boy. So the history in, in, of America and plus black history here from Paulding County has helped to enrich the, the United States, Paulding County and Georgia. Teachers that were really instrumental in uh, helping to make me and shape me who I am. Um, I think of people like uh, Miss Arnie who served as a teacher. She was my home ec teacher. <laughs> I also think of way back in the day in the, in the 80s since that's where I grew up at here in school in Paulding County. Um, people that lived in the community like uh, Sammy McClure, Miss um, uh, Miss uh, Moses, Lena Mae Moses, uh, who was also an educator here, and I graduated from Morris Brown College. She graduated from Morris Brown College back in the day when we're talking about uh, there were not very many African American teachers. People like Thurgood Marshall, he's one of my heroes. The things he endured to get where he was and to be appointed to one of the justices on the Supreme Court. That always excited me. Is black history important to you? And if so, why? Oh, black history is important because as an African-American man, not just a pastor, knowing who I am, knowing that we were kings, knowing that black people invented things, that black people created things, black people have been a, a cause to make America great. History is gonna help us learn, you know, keep going. You know, blacks have played a integral part of uh, civil rights, civil justice. Um, blacks have fought in every war, um, in every skirmish this country has ever had. And I think you cannot talk about um, history of the United States, history of even the Western world without bringing up black history and the contributions of blacks to the American experience. The fact that we set aside this month make you put a concentrated effort on, on uh, giving tribute to those African Americans who've made a contribution to uh, our society. I recall riding the school bus. One of the things that burns in my heart, one day as we were going to school, one of the landowners stopped our school bus, made some of the black students get off. And I remember his word. I told their father they was gonna chop cotton today. Get them off the bus. And that burned me. And I went to a school board meeting that was talking about getting buses to bus black kids because we had no way of getting to school but walking. I heard one of the school board members says, why should we buy buses and books? They're going to be farm hands anyway. That fire still burns in my heart. That's why even now I'm still a student. And I encourage people to study because black history without studying our history, having the goal to do better and to leave something behind that our youth would know that black people of color contribute greatly to the great United States of America. That's why it's important to me. Black history is important because it's, it's part of who we all are. Because the United States, as we know, is a melting pot. The Statue of Liberty welcomes all in to come in and be a part. And we have to make, make sure that when people come, to not just to the United States, but to Paulding County, Hiram, Dallas, um, that they feel welcome and become a part of the community so we all can work together to improve each other and our community. Paulding County has a population of almost 150,000 citizens. 
17.5% of that is black. And we have to unite. And when I say we, I'm not talking about just the black community. The entire community of Paulding County, we must unite to improve, to grow, and to make Paulding County the best county in the state of Georgia.